Oh my fucking god, are you kidding me? Nice! Yeah, I know. I'm not great at PVM, but I want to change that. Welcome everyone to a new progress video series. As you can tell from the title, I am in fact going for that in the Infernal Cape. In this series, I want to show you that yes, even a dumbass like me can get that very special Infernal Cape. However, in order to get this cape, we're going to need some stuff. And when I say stuff, I mean... This, 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 this and this. Okay, so wait, what is all this? Let's start off with Varaxel, best tanky helmet with a prayer bonus, ring of suffering, great defensive bonus, and also ring of recoil effect, toxic blowpipe, great for fast damage, necklace of anguish, also good for damage, rune pouch, saves inventory spaces for more brews, master one, has a higher magic bonus, and no negative prey bonus, armadillo crossbow, better than rune crossbow in pretty much every way, also has a prayer bonus. Serodome and Godsword provides restoration, can save tons of supplies. And Rigor, the best range prayer, with also a good defensive bonus. So there's the essential stuff I'm gonna need for the Inferno. Some other things I might need include the Armadillo Armor, Ancestrals, and an Occult Necklace, in case I don't get that from regular Slayer. I already have a couple things to start out with, which is the Trim Ranging Cape, a Crystal Shield, and Barrel's Gloves. But that's basically it. Pretty much starting from scratch here. On top of all that too, I'm an Ironman. A regular, plain Jane, Grey Helm, Ironman by the way. So the only way I'm getting these items is to, you know, learn PVM. A quick note before I begin. A lot of the original footage is lost, so most of this episode is going to be summarized over voiceover. Also, if I sound different in some of the clips, that's because they were recorded before I got my new microphone set up. So yeah, there's that. Anyways, let's begin. So I did eventually go back to Vorkath and finish the assembler grind. And finished I did. Funny thing though is that I finished the grind on mobile too. So, there's something. I'm not sure whether I'm going to use the assembler or ranging cape for the inferno though. The cape has a defense and prayer bonus, while the assembler has a better pickup and damage per second. It's just something I'm going to have to try out once I get there. After getting that, I remember I had a black tune task left over when I was still hardcore. So I went ahead and did that. Sounds like we're off to a great start, right? Of course not! This is the first time I've done a Gorilla's test, so I wasn't sure what I was getting myself into. I did this test right around the Gorilla's update came out for Roomlight too, so it wasn't that hard. Still, out of 196 kills in this test, I only got a spring and a bunch of D-Sims. Okay, seriously. Why is this spring more rare than something that's worth 11 million? I don't get it. Aside from that though, nothing interesting really happened. This was basically the entire task in a nutshell. Hey, give me a Z Knight. No! Sucks monkey fuck. Sucks monkey fuck. So after all that monkey fuck, I tried getting another Slayer task for Black Demons, but no luck. Keep in mind, I did this task more than a month ago. And as of the time of this voiceover, I still don't have a Black Demon task. Now, part of the reason for that though, it's because I've been doing barrels for the Faraxel. The reason why this is one of the first items I went for is because of the supplies that Barrows gives. Even if I don't get what I need right away, I still get tons of runes. Oh shit. Don't AFK at Barrows. Before the Barrows grind, I have never seen a white stack of anything other than money. <laughs> Which I think is pretty hilarious. On top of that too, you get other really useful Barrows items. Now, I don't have a clip of this, but I actually ended up getting Arums as my first item set. So the cool thing about this is that if I don't end up getting Ancestrals for the Inferno, I could just use this instead. <laughs> I'll take it. Hey, that's cool. And also some Carols as well. These pieces, the Arum set, Carol set, and also the runes are going to help me greatly for when I do Zola for the blowpipe. But that's not all. Surprise, motherfucker! Also completed a Torag set along the way. Not sure when this is gonna come in handy, but it's nice that I have it. Oh, okay, yeah. <laughs> nice, I got Derek's pig body. 
I got another axe. What the hell? This is like my third axe in this account. I gave one to my main. Where my alt account now? Duh, what the fuck, dude? Dude, are you kidding me? This is the third Darox piece I've gotten tonight. Tonight. What the hell? Dude, I'm almost done with Darox. Alright. What the fuck? Yep. I actually completed a full Darox set within 17 chests. And I don't even have Bird's houses set up yet. I still have to get my Herbler up a bit more for Bruise though. But at this point, I still do not have my Varax helm. I was approaching 500 chest count without the helm. I was getting pretty tired at this point, but my patience did eventually pay off. Oh my god! Congratulations!